This week, the world mourned the loss of Tyree Nichols. I lost my faith. I cried. I screamed at God, asking how could he let this happen? The fallout from the beating and emergency response to the 29-year-old sparked multiple investigations, leading to five MPD officers facing criminal charges, three MFD EMTs being fired, and two Shelby County Sheriff deputies being under investigation. WREG reached out to Shelby County District Attorney's Office, and a spokesperson confirmed to us it is possible more charges are coming. In a statement, they said, quote, there have been questions about other officers and fire department personnel on the scene, persons remotely operating cameras, and the potential of false reporting. We are now at the stage of our investigation where we are looking into all of these matters. We must reemphasize that the current charges do not preclude us from adding additional charges. In an interview with CNN, District Attorney Steve Moroy told them that there is up to 20 hours of unreleased footage relating to Tyree Nichols. A spokesperson with the city of Memphis confirmed to WREG a family attorney has reviewed that footage. Meanwhile, as the community awaits the results from multiple investigations, Nichols' family has vowed to see this to the very end. This is a continuous fight that we have to fight for. That's right. We have to fight for justice. Yeah. We cannot continue to let these people brutalize our kids. And the city tells me that it could be a few weeks before that video is made public. We have reached out to MPD for an update and are still waiting to hear from them. Reporting here live outside of City Hall, Jordan James, WREG, News Channel 3. All right, hopefully we'll hear something soon, Jordan, thanks. And just minutes ago, Mayor Strickland announced in his weekly newsletter that the city has appointed the Department of Justice's Office of Community Oriented Policing Services, or COPS for short, in partnership with the Collaborative Reform Initial Technical Assistance Center and International Association of Police Chiefs to conduct an official review of the Memphis Police Department. The independent external review by these agencies will include an assessment of MPD's special